Greetings and welcome to another jailbreak update. So in this jailbreak update, we will cover the latest and the greatest progress for the Neko jailbreak and towards the end, we will cover Dopamine's 2.0 version briefly and discuss what it is. So as you can see it right here, the Neko jailbreak is now in its final stages. So expect a public beta very very soon. So now they just have to fix the random panics and improve the stability of this jailbreak. So as you can see it right here, we have the list to see what's done and the next up. So set UID is fixed, fork is fixed, rootless hooks are fixed and the main update for this video is that Neko jailbreak gained the tweak injection. So now your tweaks work just fine while you are jailbroken with the Neko jailbreak. So next up is Boomerang and the public beta. And of course, fix the random panics, improve stability. And also, Rootful will come with the Neko jailbreak in a later release. And yes, iOS 16 support is also planned for a later release and then you'll get the final release that is version 1.0 also to prove that the tweak injection is now working with the neko jailbreak you can see this neko jailbreak demo on the official twitter page for the developer so they have tested it with gestures 10 v so as you can see we have the jailbreak progress right here after a respring you can see that we have the iPhone 10 or later gestures on this iPhone 7 which is running iOS 15.7.5 and guys we have yet another demo for the Neko jailbreak with two tweaks installed right now so Atria and gestures 10v as you can see it right here on this iPhone 7 so after the jailbreak process is complete you can see that gestures 10v is working just fine as you can see this home bar right here you can see that the atria tv is also working as you can see this custom home screen layout also guys if you want to stick with the latest and the greatest progress updates for the neko jailbreak you can join their official discord from right here and also the website for the neko jailbreak is also almost done as you can see it right here and yes upon release the neko jailbreak will be completely free for everybody now as you can see in this screenshot there have been some issue that apps like side load leave were not correctly installing the neko jailbreak app and were getting stuck at extracting bin pack so luckily this issue has been resolved and you can see it is installed on this iphone 6s they fixed this issue by making neko jailbreak download the necessary binaries instead of bundling them with the ipa file now on the other hand you can see that dopamine 2.0 might also come which will support your a11 and lower devices meaning the arm 64 devices on all the versions which are supported by the kfd meaning 15.0 through 15.7.6 and 16.0 through 16.5 and 16.6 beta 1 but the work for dopamine 2.0 hasn't even really started yet so let's see what the future holds that's all for this jailbreak update if i have more information to share i will definitely do it with you i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care of yourself